What up guys, Nick here. This is day six and I felt like complete crap all day. I'm dead serious. I had a company meeting in the in the morning today and I just it was with my team and my manager and basically I was like panicking I had extreme anxiety I held it together for some of the stuff that I said but there were some some things that uh, I feel like people noticed that I was kind of freaking out. That's not like me at all. So, you know, I don't, it's, it was just a, and then I had other meetings today and it's hard to think clearly, you know? This is really bad. It's the same way that I felt when I was tapering, except that lasted the pause or whatever it is after the physical. Well, I mean, I still feel physical though. It's not just psychological and mental because my back has been killing me all day today. So the muscle aches are still there. I didn't sleep at all last night, basically. I tried to wake up for the gym this morning and just couldn't do it. I didn't eat any lunch today, which is just, I'm literally doing everything wrong, but I'm trying to push through. I'm gonna eat some, some food in a second here. And I'm gonna try to get up and go to the gym tomorrow morning. I really need to do that. Um, so, you know, all in all, I held that together decently, given how I was actually feeling. So I'm proud of that, you know? I can, I can be positive about that. And I hope it doesn't get worse, that's all. I can say, cause there's only so much I can handle, man. I can't be on a lot of calls and like freaking out on the calls. It's just not gonna go well. But I'm not gonna give up. I already, you know, made it one day. I felt fine on day five and now day six rolls around and just complete 180, it's crazy. So I think I just gotta take better care of my, my body. Um, get more sleep, try to, I gotta go to the gym and I gotta eat. It's part of, you know, when you take Kratom, you don't you don't ever eat basically, or you can go without eating and it's fine. Now I'm like starving and my brain needs food to make it through. So, hopefully this story was educational. <laughs> Good luck if you're also trying to Quit Kratom, it's, it's day six and it's worse than day one or day two. That's the difference between like Kratom and I've quit nicotine. I quit nicotine last year and I'm not picking it up ever again. I'm done with that. But like the day after you quit nicotine, even the hours after you're, you know, you're, you're craving it. It's really all mental and physical too. You're like reaching for your, your vape or whatever you ingest nicotine with. Um, whereas this, I felt fine for the first five days. I mean, there was little stuff here and there, but day six and wow, hit me like a freight train right on the day that I had work too, of course. So hopefully tomorrow is better. And I'll go ahead and try to make another update tomorrow for you guys. Good luck. It's uh, it's definitely a challenge. I always like a challenge, but I also gotta keep composed when I'm working because it's not fair to my company or anybody else. So, Nick out, reach out to me. Um, subscribe if you like my videos. And we'll see you uh, tomorrow most likely. I'll give you an update. Bye.